This tutorial will show you how to deploy the file source security all in one step using the Cloud One console. If you wish to deploy a standalone scanner, you can follow this tutorial as well. After you sign to Cloud One file source security, select the stack management page, select Azure, and click on deploy. You have the options to deploy a standalone scanner or an all in one stack, which includes provisioning both the scanner and a storage stack under the same Azure subscription. In order to prepare for running the template, the first step is to sign to your Azure Active Directory on the Azure portal and prepare one service principal link to Fauster Security's app registration. Each Azure Active Directory needs only one service principal link to Fauster Security's app registration. To create it, Execute the Prepare Service Principal ID Azure CLI command and save the Service Principal ID for later. Next, click on Launch Stack. This will direct you to the Azure Custom Deployment page. On this page, specify the subscription to deploy the stack. Select an Azure region you wish to deploy. The region must be supported by Fauster Security. Specify the service principal ID you retrieved earlier. Specify the region to which the scanner and storage stacks will connect to for Cloud One services such as Fauster Security Console, Event Management Services, and Telemetry Services. The list of supported Cloud One region can be found in our documentation. Specify the name of the scanner stack and the storage stack. Specify the resource ID of the storage account that you wish to protect. Select Yes if the system topic of the protecting storage account has already created and specify its name. If not, select No and the system topic will be deployed with the name you specify. You do not need to modify any of the other parameters. At the bottom of the page, click Review and Create. Confirm the information and are correct on the next page and select Create. Once the stacks are created, in your all-in-one stack deployment, click on the Outputs tab. Copy the Tenant ID, Scanner Stack Resource Group ID, and Storage Stack Resource Group ID and paste them back to the Cloud One console. Click on Submit. After a few seconds, you will see that both stacks were successfully deployed. 